everyone it's your girl paris and i am back with a brand new video what better way to bring in the springtime than making your bed nice and fresh for the upcoming season i am super excited to be sharing my spring bedding decor with you all and thank you all so much for showing love on all of my recent videos so Make sure before you go any further that you check out my previous um, luxury bedding idea. I'm pretty sure you'll like that as well. I'm going to be sharing my ideas and sharing exactly how I came up with this look. I'm sure you all will love it. Okay, so before we jump into today's video, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe. And always remember to have fun and let those creative juices flow because you can come up with so many great ideas within your home and also in your life. We're about to get started in one, two, three. All right, y'all. Okay, so if you cannot tell already, one of my favorite colors is green. Hence the reason for the bedding color. So we're gonna start off with my quilt set. I love the texture and material of this particular quilt. If you come a bit closer, you can just see the true color and also the design of the quilt. And I believe this particular quilt came from Marshalls or either TJ Maxx as well. And it's really good quality. So, the quilt also has a cream colored trim that goes around the whole entire quilt. So I really do like that. And for this particular design for my bed, I chose to leave the quilt hanging. So if you check out my last video, I tucked my um, comforter set, but for this particular look, we're just gonna leave it hanging. I really do like that look. I think it's very like polished and it gives like really upscale hotel vibes. So for this particular quilt design, we decided to fold it as you can see and I'm going to insert a video clip of how we achieve this folded look right now. As you can see in that particular clip we folded the quilt set and this is the end result. So now we're going to move on to what really elevates the bed. For me, I am not afraid to layer and add multiple colors of green. So as you can see, we decided to add this um, fleece blanket over the quilt. It just adds more dimension and makes it look aesthetically pleasing. I just love how all the greens play so beautifully um, on each other. It really looks good to me. And on top of that, because, you know, we are into design and just having our space look so good, I decided to add an additional layer with this blanket right here. And I just think that it looks so modern, classy, and it's just a representation of how I feel like. I love it. Every time I go to bed, I get so happy. And every time I look at my bed, it brings a smile to my face. So it's so simple. And you can find these type of blankets at your local home store, TJ Maxx, Home Goods, like stores we all shop at. Very inexpensive, budget friendly. So hopefully you take this layering consideration into mind. And as you can see, like I said, it's literally a quilt for the base, a fleece blanket that is going across the entire bed, and then on top of the fleece blanket, we just have another lighter blanket. And I hope you all like it too and get some ideas from it. As long as you have your color scheme in mind, you can make a beautiful bedding decor. Now, I'll just gonna work my way up to the top. The quilt has this lovely white trim around it and I love that detail. That small detail is really important because it just makes the bedding look even more expensive and 
I just love small details like that. So, um, for obvious reasons, um, this is my sheet set. <laughs> Just so I can just throw that out there. Because it's springtime, or it's about to be spring, it's gonna be warming up. Warming up. I don't like to be hot. The previous comforter set I had, if you check out my other video, it was super hot. So this is much more doable and not as hot for the spring and summertime. But anyway, we're gonna start with our first layer of pillows. And these are horizontal shaped pillows. They are like a soft cream white and I just love how they look you can tell that they have a really pretty texture to them and they look really expensive and remember pillows can be any shape and size you just have to be creative remember it's all about being creative now since we love layering pillows I am huge on layering pillows and look what I have I have another shade of green like I said before, do not be afraid with playing with colors. And for the second layer of pillows, I'm literally going to just align them together. Not directly straight up. Just gonna position the pillow to rest on the other pillow, like so. Right, so following me so far? So, second layer of pillows, right? If you're a pillow lover like me, this is not gonna scare you. Look, the more pillows, the merrier, okay? For our third layer of pillow, we are going to use this beautiful one right here. I really do like it. It was on my previous bedding decor video. Check that out. I'll make sure to link it in the description box below. But it's really pretty. I get a lot of compliments on it. And as you can see, it's slowly but surely coming together. And it's just, to me, it's so pleasing to the eye and I love it. All right, so we are going to add one last pillow. But it's really important to play around with your pillows because to me, in my opinion, pillows really make the bed come fully together. And as you can see, we have different colors, but they all are within the same family, basically. Yes, it's different color greens, but it goes beautifully together as one. And it just adds more elevation and just a more polished look to your bed. So I have a pillow hack for everybody watching. Let me show you what this pillow says on the front, right? Merry Christmas. However, do not be afraid to let those creative juices flow. And what I'll simply do is just turn the pillow to the opposite side. You'll never know. And this is going to be my last pillow. Look how easy that was to accomplish. And you would never know that it said Merry Christmas unless I told you all. So we are finally at the end of today's video. And I just want to bring to your attention one more time how everything ties in together. Just how I was explaining the white trim on the quilt set. If you think about it and look at the bed, it also ties in with this pillow right here. Because it has the white fringe on both sides of this pillow. The white is also incorporated with this throw right here, or this blanket. If you come up here, we have the white incorporated with these pillows right here. It all plays together so nicely. I really do like it. And when you shop, just take your time. And to me, it comes naturally. So hopefully for you, it comes naturally too. But if it doesn't, let your girl know and I can help you out. I love meeting you all, sharing ideas with people, watching my videos. So feel free to message me if you need help in the decorating realm. I got you. So it looks like you made it to the very end of today's video. And I hope you enjoyed it. And as always, I am here if you have any questions. 
and thank you so so much for showing my channel all the love make sure that you like comment and subscribe and i'll be back with another video very soon for you all i love y'all bye all right i'm out <laughs>